What is good, everybody? XMSA HD here, back again on Black Ops 2, back again on track with videos, and I'm feeling really good, and I'm happy to make commentaries now, which is, you know, that's really nice, and I'm kind of, I'm proud of my own self in this sake for staying on track, because I'm not the most organized person, and I'm happy I'm kind of, I got a little schedule going. <laughs> but this is a demolition on the uh, map carrier, playing some Chaos Mosh Pit, and... I don't know. I've, I've never tried out this game mode. This this was no like no joke. This was my first time ever playing in a Chaos Moshpit game, and you know I love it. Wow, I I didn't realize. I don't know. Just the kids are not of the greatest skill, and I literally just took it to the house with this one, picking up the VSAT, and then that led to my VTOL, and then that led to my swarm, and I think I finished this game up going, I think it was 69 and 7, something in that range, maybe it was like, uh, maybe it was like 67 and 7, something like that, I can't exactly remember perfectly, but I don't show you the full gameplay here, it's just, uh, some of these games are too long, and I feel like I need to cut it down to 4 or 5 minutes, and that's what I'm doing here, showing you the most exciting parts of the game, where I first pick up the swarm, and then the second round, where I actually call in my VTOL warship, and just just tear the house down with that but a big issue i would like to address is just rage quitting in black ops 2 it's something i don't know if many people will notice if you're like i'm not trying to put this in a bad way but like the i mean the more skilled players on call of duty definitely notice this or even if you play with a full party you probably notice it because your team would just do so amazing it's the fact that I mean, I play a lot of Ground War. I play a lot of Ground War. Let me just say that now. I've recently started doing that, and this is where I've mainly noticed it. It's that when your team even gets, like, a VTOL warship, any kill streak that's just so deadly to the enemy team that they really they can't get out of their spawn, they just get death after death after death, they just get so angry by that. They can't take the fact that they're just continuously dying over and over again, so they just leave. I don't, I'm kind of confused in the sake that, why hasn't this really happened in previous Call of Duties? I feel like I've never seen so much rage quitting. I'll give you a, a prime example. I've just, I just play Ground War, I pick up a swarm, and the, I get, <laughs> I get a five man with, I mean, I get like five kills within like three seconds, and the enemy team's just, they just rage. They can't take the fact anymore, and I mean, it's understandable in one way. I mean, for me, it's just awful because I worked hard for the swarm. I worked hard for the dogs. I worked hard for all the kill streaks, and I just don't really have the opportunity to use them, which just sucks and all. And I don't know. I'd really like to hear your feedback if you think people are just rage quitting too much in Black Ops Two, and what you would think, like Treyarch, should be doing about this. In my opinion, what I think they should do. It's, I don't know, it's controversial to say what, what you should do, but I feel it's not fair to leave a game. I like, in a way, I like what Halo Reach, or Halo Reach did. I do not have Halo 4, so I can't say I know. But in Halo Reach, you were penalized if you left too many games, and I believe you just went on probation for a certain amount of time. And I think that's fair enough, because they're first, now they're putting people on probation for um, dashboarding games, or turning off your Xbox, where you have the do not finish modifier type of shit going. And, I mean, yeah, I'm Black Ops 2, and I think that's that's a pretty fair thing to do. I hate um, someone dashboarding a game just to save their stats if they're getting wrecked in one game. But I think now some penalties should be taken if you're continuously just leaving game after game after game after game. And another thing that like just is also controversial, it's like, well, what if I join a game and my team's getting wrecked? I wouldn't want to stay in that. And it's just like, it's it's hard to say, but I, I kind of hope Call of Duty would do something about the rage quitting. I, I don't know what they can do, really. That's why I'm asking for your own opinion. But this is XMSA HD here. I want to thank you all for watching. Have a great day, guys.